Good morning, everybody. Good morning. If you're new, welcome. I'm Ryan. This is Aaron. We dumpster dive. We do Dollar Tree hauls, DIYs, whatever we want. <laughs> we have fun. And if you're not new, we love you. You know how much we love you. And thank you so much. You guys don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and make sure your notification bell's turned on to all and not personalized. That way you never miss an upload. And PetSmart, here we come. PetSmart dumpster. What is it? Oh, there's dog food. Cage. Score, guys. In the box. I know y'all can barely see anything. We've got to get a better light. We do have headlamps. I'm just not sure where they are right now. Is that the bottom? Um, is it broken? Mm -mm. Look for the rest of it. I wonder if it's a kit. Nice, we got a... Dog food. Oh, pick it up by the that side. Oh my goodness! Holy crap! Wow! I have a huge box of litter in my arms, and it is heavy. Crap. I hope you can see you guys.
Don't forget guys, always leave it like you found it. Holy moly. But guys, look, we loaded the trunk at one stop. Oh my goodness. Okay. Is it closed? And look, there's more. <laughs> Get the light on. <laughs> We're just gonna leave our light on the damn on the hood, I guess. Um, wow, that was crazy. Um, whew, I'm out of breath. Those bags of dog food were effing huge. This is uh, staples, like she said. There's usually nothing in it, but you never freaking know, right? Even my hands are even cold with my gloves on, guys. Holy crap. See you when we get to Raj. Oh, why can't I ever say that? <laughs> See you when you get to Raj. When we get to Ross slash Michael's dumpster in Bed Bath & Beyond. Lord have mercy. Anyways, see you in a minute. <laughs> Michael's dumpster. Ulta was freaking empty, guys, of course. Dang it. This one has the light, honey, so if you just open the lid, you won't have to hold that. Y'all should have seen that whole thing. I wish I was standing farther back. <laughs> but he caught himself. Oh my goodness. <laughs> he just dives in like treasure hustlers. But they flip out of them, them dumpsters. They crack me up, man. Love them girls. I think I stepped on it. Well, if you didn't break the frame, then I don't care about the glass. That's what I was talking about, the frame. Oh no. Yeah. Is it good? I think so, baby. Yeah. Oh, that. no. oh, that's just a little oh, wood glue. Okay. Oh, get it out of there. These are our most common finds at this dumpster. Is these black frames that come in these boxes. I don't know what it is about their shipping manufacturer, but they screw things up all the time, apparently. There's nothing, guys. Dang it. Just dang it. I still want this thing so bad. I want this sucker. Dang it. Wouldn't that be cool? Like, even organizing poly mailers or fabric or whatever. It'd be cool. I want it. But we still have to get the van. Battery's dead in it. And it's just not... It's not ready yet. There we go. Heron can always maneuver it in there where I can't. Alright, so we will try Bed Bath and Beyond Dumpster. Alright, here we go. your boogers. <laughs> Is it boogers? Y'all would let me know, right? I mean, I'm just saying. Someone oh, yeah, would let me know. Someone, someone better let me know. All right. Do you not remember the comment? Oh, yeah. You got a boogie. Yeah, I, no, no someone left me that comment one day. <laughs> Do you not remember the conversations we had during live? <laughs> oh, yeah. That was so much fun. Bed bath and me on dumpster. We will see you at CBS Dumpster. Go Hogs. <laughs> Look, I got a sweater. Three and Finally. Three and I got a small enough. <laughs> yes. To fit their flipping clothes. Let Russ cook. <laughs> Anyways, see you there. CBS. 
dumpster. See me as dumpster. See me as dumpster. Can you even take a light? <laughs> he just realized it. <laughs> oh, poor baby. He's running on no sleep. I shouldn't be laughing at him. No, he does all this just for all of us and mostly me though. Like I see comments that are like, Well your husband could smile or he always looks so mad or whatever, but guys he's not. He's tired. He's exhausted. He's also flipping the lid up, which makes me think I need to get out. Yep. <laughs> Here we go, guys. Holy crap, guys. Yep, I'm definitely gonna need both hands. Yeah. Here. Come on. Okay, guys, I'm gonna set you on the dash. a view real quick and then I'm going to shut the camera off because um, he needs my hands. But look at all this. I wish I could hold you guys. But like, holy crap. There's so much stuff again. Okay guys, I'm turning you off and you'll see it in the hall. Whoa guys. Uh, <laughs> again, the freaking um <laughs> Thank gosh, it was only the cardboard truck, but they showed up on us again, so you wouldn't have been able to hear nothing anyways, but we're just packed. Like, we're packed. Two stops and we're like packed, packed, packed. Uh, we're still going to hit Dollar Tree and see, but um, y'all give Aaron a thumbs up because, yeah, buddy. Oh, baby. Mm -hmm. Look at that, though. Holy crap only. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. And the trunk is the same way. <laughs> yes. Woohoo. Dollar Tree Dumpster. Dollar Tree Dumpster. Let's go see what we can find at the Dollar Tree Dumpster. I hope it blows my freaking mind. Dollar Tree Dumpster. Let's go check. And hopefully we don't break our effing neck at the Dollar Tree Dumpster. Dun, dun, dun. Baby, there's a whole box of something over here. It looks like right there. What does it say damaged? Throw out. I wonder how many's damaged in it. That one looks like another box of whatever it is. What is it? Oh, yeah. Is it bad? Oh, none of them are savable. Nope. Fuck. All right, you guys. So, um, unless we just, well, actually, we should go hit Petco while we have time. Petco dumpster doesn't look like they're open. We're gonna have to haul booty up this place. Hey, dog food. Bags of dog food. We gotta hurry, guys. Yeah. Look at this mess. Mm -hmm. Look at this effing mess back here. That makes me upset. What's in that black bag, I wonder? Oh, yes, give me that. I'm taking it straight to the car. Hand it here, hurry. 
Oh my goodness, you guys. Give me that one. Give me that one too. Uh, too short. Uh. Here, baby. I can't. Short girl problems. Guys, I'm gonna have to turn you off for a minute, all right? I'm sorry. <laughs> we just fit it in the car, like all of it. And we found a pet carry, uh, um, kennel, and- With the tray. Uh, I'm so out of breath from doing that. I cannot believe we just got all that in here, as packed as the car already is. Like, it, we are packed to the flipping brim, mega, Epic freaking score today, you guys. We haven't scored like this in a cool minute. This, yeah. yes, thank you, Jesus. So blessed. We've gotten something from just about every place. Other than Bed so, Bath and Beyond. Yeah, all. except for Alton Bed That's Bath and Beyond. Common. But we are headed to Joanne's. And then we'll look at Barnes and Noble. Locked. That is that Joanne's? Yeah. Oh, yep, yeah, locked, locked, guys. JC Penney's is locked. <sighs> we'll see if Barnes and Noble is. Um, Barnes and Noble. Okay. <clears throat> There's nothing. Epic day. I'm so excited. That's it and that's all for the dumpster dive part of this uh, video because, well, we're packed. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus and Aaron and uh, all you guys Good for job. watching. Y'all hit that thumbs up button because it really helps YouTube to notice our channel. Um, keeps us in the algorithm. You know the drill. See when we do the haul. <laughs> you guys, we just hit at TJ Maxx. I can't, we haven't hit there in so long, but we decided to come check Pier 1 because they're supposed to be going out of business. It was empty, but I was like, well, while we're here, let's just check TJX. Like, and we haven't hit there in so long, and we just did. So, like, there's even more stuff. I don't know how we managed it. We got in the car. <laughs> and this is gonna be an epic haul, you guys. Like, epic. Dude, wow, my oh, baby. Yeah. You, uh, <laughs> whoa, okay, you guys. Like, really, I think we're actually done for the day. Um. So, I really will this time. See you in the hall. Bye-bye. <laughs> All right, you guys. Welcome back to our channel. Uh, we got a humongous haul for you guys. Um, not only from what you've seen in the footage. A couple days after that, we had to go to the next town and um, do some work for a friend of mine who almost had an eviction notice. So we had to go in and take care of that. But um, when we did, I don't know if y'all remember nice, sweet Marsha, um, who used to um, just call me up or text me up or whatever and be like, hey, I've got stuff for you from Bed Bath & Beyond. She happened to do that and was like, let me know next time you're in town. And so I messaged her that day. I said, we're in town. So we go by and uh, our house and pick up the stuff that she gave us, which was almost a car full itself, not counting the dive that we got ourselves. And so on the way from leaving her house, I really want a spirit haul this haul this year, you guys. We haven't gotten a spirit haul yet. And I said, hun, let's just run by and check spirit. And Bed Bath & Beyond happens to be in the same parking lot in that town. And I said, well, we might as well check it. We're here. We hit again. <laughs> I didn't have the camera. <laughs> so it's unfilmed footage, but you're going to get to see the haul. So we hit at Bed Bath & Beyond there, and then we hit in the footage you guys have just seen. And then we So we woke up to this. <laughs> Yay. And usually we film... Um, our hall's right there up against the shed, which was the plan for this one, um, was to film it up against the shed like we did the last couple, but, um, that's not going to happen now because it's freezing out here. So with that said, we're going to give you a little sneak peek of what's inside the van and then we're going to take it all inside the house and do it old school like we used to and, uh, show you what all we got. So here's what the van looks like right now. <laughs> 
Yep, and it is piled all the way to the front seat. Upon re-entering the house, um, I decided that I should probably show you guys. Uh, this is our living room right now. <laughs> yep, we are, um, mm-hmm. And I'll, again, see you in just a second. <laughs> also, the girls say hello. 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 All right. Keeper's back there on her little... Her little perch. There she is. And Bella. <laughs> you guys, you guys did this and she's gonna be the most beautiful. I mean, not that she's not, but she's gonna be perfect because of you guys. You guys did that. And this new bed. You guys did that too. And her favorite new toy. Y'all did this. Y'all are amazing. So, um, all right, we'll see you in a minute. <laughs> Dog drool on my chin. <laughs> so we got it all in the house and you guys, OMG, like, okay, are you ready? I'm gonna give you an overview and grab a drink because, <laughs> whoa. All right, here we go. So, <laughs> here's, um, yep, all the way to there. All the way to there, all the way up there. Excuse me, sir. All the way up there. So there's four bags high of grab bags back there. Um, yeah, so let's jump right into it. <laughs> Can anybody say epic jackpot and hit that thumbs up for us right now? <laughs> if you've never been here before, I'm Ryan. This is Aaron. We dumpster dive DIY. We do what we want, kind of. We have fun doing it. He's always licking my ear. I guarantee you'll get a laugh out of us and you'll enjoy hanging out with us. For all the OG subscribers, y'all know how much we love you. So thank you so much for all your love and support. And let's get the heck into this haul. Ready, set, babe? Let's get her done. Y'all grab a snack. This is a Bed Bath & Beyond. Was that from Marsha or did we find that? I don't remember. Um, Annabelle table lamp. That's all it says. And then this was a find, and it's one of the stands for the drink dispensers from Bed Bath & Beyond. And um, I just thought, you know what? You could do a ton with this. DIY, you could make a plant stand out of it. And then this was Bed Bath & Beyond. And this one we found the same day that Marsha gave us the stuff. And oh my goodness, is it really all there? Oh my goodness. That's metal, that is amazing. It's got the place for your soap that you wanna use. It's got a um, drain got hole, it's got wheels on it. You can wheel it, drain hole it, comes oh, with all that crap. Look. Okay, so the other pole doesn't go to it. So it's got its own pole. So we have a pole that is unknown, but it looks like this and it's orange. So you'll see it in a minute. So that is amazing. That is all there. And it is not spray painted, you guys, at all. So there's the mop. And then from PetSmart or Petco, I don't remember which one, PetSmart. we found a kennel. And you can tell that it's just been put together because the screws, some of them are still in here. So we got a perfectly brand new 24-inch stack kennel. Um, this was from Miss Marsha. And she is an OG family member, and I know y'all know her if you're an OG. If you're not, she's always calling us up and giving us Bed Bath & Beyond stuff. And um, so this was one from her, and that is unbelievable. And it is a 228-centimeter by 228-centimeter. So that's a big fleece blanket. And again, no paint that I see. So that's amazing. Thank you, Marsha. I love that. Then we found a, well, most people call them guinea pig cages. I, on the other hand, have guinea pigs over there upon my mess. Sorry about that. But this is the size cage they should be in. I have one in each. And these should be illegal to sell unless you're only using them to travel. That is my personal opinion, but actually it's a fact too. Either way, here's a um, All Living Things <laughs> guinea pig cage. It is all there as far as the cage. I think it was a starter cage and it's missing the ramp, accessories, etc. But it's still a brand new cage. Marsha sent a waffle maker. The cord is cut, but 
Aaron wants to fix it because it, it comes with all these different cool um, little sandwich inserts and all that stuff. So you just pop them out and then pop which ones in you want. And it can be a sandwich griddle or a waffle maker or... Yeah. So then there's um, two of the crock pot um, holders. One's a little deeper than the other. And I believe they will fit my crock pot. One's so a bit. Um, that's awesome. And then um, I found this pooper scooper. And then I dropped the darn thing and broke it. <laughs> So I'm um, going to see if my stepdad can um, just screw a bolt through there because he's been wanting one like this. And yeah, so um, if you can't, you know, it is what it is. So there's that. And then we have uh, Pet Smart or Pet Co Find. I don't remember that day which one we got where from. And it's a fish tank starter kit. Okay. So there's the light. Here's the tank. Is there's it cracked? Me. Nope. You're kidding me. No, I'm not. Well, it will still be placed into the tub and tested, as I do all of them. Right here. But it does have all the accessories. So we got this. That's amazing. This has a $149 price tag on it. It is a fish tank filter, three stage, 30 to 60 gallon. Don't know what that means, but we have found one like this before, but it was not in the Holy box. Cow. And I believe this one is all here. It's just a little dirty. So we will be testing this to make sure that it comes on. Definitely for a big fish tank. I do want to say this. If you guys see anything in these halls that you would like for me to create boxes from, comment below. Tell me. Um, I'm going to start creating boxes. It's going to become a regular thing. We're going to do the dang thing. <laughs> um, so, But I want to know what you guys want. If you want something big like this, like this filter, uh, email me. We'll figure out the shipping. We'll figure out a good deal. We'll go from there. Uh, my email is always in the description box below, or I'll put it right here. And let's get on with the haul. So we found a kennel, and I believe this one was a Petco find. And it is a medium size. I'm not. I mean, a small size. Sorry about that. It's all here. Um, we found this little trash can doodad. Oh, nope. TJ Maxx. So this is one of the things we found. And it's one of the, you know, lower by itself. And it doesn't appear bent or broke or... Wow. Oh, okay. There we go. That's why. But still, who cares? All right, moving right along. I taped this, but so there's supposed to be 64 in it. I wasn't about to take them all out and count them. Hopefully they're all there. It looks pretty full. They are a size three medium um, um, incontinent CVS brand um, pads for the ladies. And that's full. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me. <laughs> All right, so moving right along. We got some snacker whackers from um, CVS. CVS, yep. So we got Kashi, Cheetos, popcorn. Okay, these were um, the TJ Maxx. They were in TJ Maxx, and these actually light up. I said, get them. I'm going to put them in my sewing room. We will DIY with these, even if I only use the letters. Those are real wood. And there's three of them, or two of them, two of them. Okay, so then, um, CVS, we got some jerky, some more jerky. So then we got, uh, Flamin' Hot Cheetos popcorn. Haven't tried that yet. Moving right along, we got a bag that's open. But the, all the little bags are still there of the, damn it, I meant darn it, honey roasted mixed nuts. Yes. All right, all right, all right. We got a CVS hot and cold, feels like, um, pack, bunch of trolls. And are they expired? Um, 10, 13, 20. So,
so um, just by a few days ago. So we got some Nutrigrain bars, but individually wrapped. So amazing. Foundation. Um, we got a Pedialyte, and it is in a bag, so it's leaking somewhere. So that'll have to go into another bottle. This was a TJ Maxx find, coconut wax blend. Oh, smell that, you guys. Mm. Yes. I have plenty of jars. I'll just get this sucker out of there, put it in a new jar, and we'll be burning it and smelling that great vanilla cinnamon smell. More trolls. More makeup. We got wet and wild. Um... Golden honey. Ouch. This is hurting me on my knees, y'all. Hold on. Alright. So we got some pumpkin seeds. We got some infusions with caught tuna. Okay, now this is something, if it is out of date, unless it's like a cat food or something. I don't know. I'll have to look into this. But um, if it was stored on a shelf... I'm still pretty hesitant with tuna, so 314, 20, 314, 20. That's way out of date. That's going in the trash. Okay. Uh, we got more trolls. We got some single little uh, cinnamon coffee cake. Um, more honey rusted notes. Notes. <laughs> honey rusted notes. Oh my goodness, my English today. Wow. Honey roasted nuts, chewy, and then some granola bars, um, Cliff Bar, more jerky. We got some Burt's Bees, Chastic. Uh, we got Bumblebee Snack on the Run. What's the date on it though? Tuna scares me like that. Best Buy 1221. Okay, wow, really? Yeah. So they must have threw it out for damage packaging. All right, the rest is just Cliff, Cliff bar. bars and granola bars, and y'all already seen it. Mm -hmm. So let's move right along. Um, we got a card uh, in the mail. The card is from Irva Thrift. Did I say that right? Yes. <laughs> Irva, I know exactly who you are. I just misread your name. I'm sorry, baby. Anyways, um, here's the card. And thank you so much, sweetheart. So here's the beautiful card. And it's going to go up on our wall of cards. And it says, For sweet friendship refreshes the soul. Proverbs 27, 19. Thank you, baby. And on the inside, it looks like this. And then it says, Oh, look at the little peeking man she drew. <laughs> That's cute. Thank God for you, your smiles you bring, and the sweet blessings of friendships we enjoy. My girl, <laughs> thank you. You're making me blush. Thank you for all you and Aaron do with us. <laughs> Love, Irva. You're welcome, baby. Thank you for the card. Aw. Hugs. <laughs> That's so sweet. Thank you so much. And then I also had a card um, come with an invitation that I didn't get to show you guys. That was from Miss Paula. It's an owl, and it says, thank you so much. And it came with her wedding invitation. And then it says, Ryan and family, thank you for what you have done for my wedding. I wish you could be here for it. Thank you, Paula, Jim, and Jake. Oh, I know, Paula. I wish we could too, baby. Just timing sucks right now, especially in the middle of a pandemic. But this is going up on the wall. Let's get back into this haul. <laughs> But ladies, thank you so much, and we love you so much, and mwah. All right, moving right along. So we got a big, huge thing of kitty litter. It's open, but full. And then there's one in the box as well. This frame came from Ross, Michael's dumpster. So we got that. Four bags of dog food this time, two we are keeping. Um, I did have to tape it up in a spot where it was torn. But this is the Purina Pro this is the Purina Pro Plan adult. And I think this is a 60 pound bag and it's beef. And then I'm gonna keep this one and this one. Um 
And then there's the blue buffalo. And that is a 30 pound bag. Okay, so there's the dog food we got. Moving right along. Woo! We got a $60. Holy crap. Bark collar. Open it up. Let's see no what's in there. Collar. No bark collar. Well, same difference. While he's doing that, y'all look what else. I don't remember where this came from, but it's freaking adorable. And oh, I think it was Pet Smart. That is so cute. I think what it's missing is the pad that goes in here, like for the bed part. But that is still so cute for a little kitty cat house. Look at this. Wow. That is beautiful. Brand new, huh? So, is it all there? We had all the extras? Mm -hmm. All right. So, we got a brand new um, no bark collar. We got some more disposable diapers. They are size extra large. It appears that there is about three out of it. And those are for the female dog. Um, we got, and I did count this one. There's only one missing. This is for the extra small. This is for the male dog. See how it wraps around just the um, girth? Or Is that right? Girth, yeah. And then we got two huge freaking bags. 150 count each of dog pads. And the reason why is because they were sliced upon opening the box on the side. So I'm going to say on this one, this first pad is no good. But on this one, on the other side, they sliced all the way down. So the first two pads are no good. Other than that, these are in perfect condition. So that is 300 dog pads we got for free. I'm pretty sure this beautiful, beautiful thing fell out of one of the ah, Bed Bath & Beyond bags. And girls and boys, let me tell you what. That's my shiznit. Hazelnut Starbucks. It's on our haul, we did find this from Bed Bath & Beyond. This is a memory foam topper. That is still in the bag. Holy crap. Do we see a size? But anyways, there's just a little bit of spray paint on it. And so, yeah, we got that, and I'm not sure what brand it is, but... Oh. Y'all, we might have the whole freaking thing right here. Yep, it is. That's exactly what it is. Yep, proper fit of topper. One inch memory foam, not a three. So we got a brand new topper, and um, it's queen, so 58 by 7, and this has not got no spray spray paint, so it's going to cover that, and we're going to have a brand new looking one. So, there's that. Wow. What a score, y'all. What a score. All right. This bag is from Marsha. I do know that. And again, it is Bed Bath & Beyond. So, we got a... You know what it looks like? Something that goes on your sink to hang your towels off of. Or in your shower to hang your wash rags off of, maybe. What do y'all think? I'm thinking that. So, yeah. Okay, so we got that. That's pretty cool if that's what it is. Ooh, yes. So we got a, a hot pack. Uh, you warm these up, I believe, in the microwave. And um, put them around your neck and your shoulders and your back. And this is the first one I've ever gotten that wasn't spray painted. Holy moly. Or had a tear in it. Or anything. And I wonder if it's got the brand. Bed Buddy. Haha. <laughs> Nice. All right, we got some beautiful curtains. Are they spray painted? Crap. Yeah. Well, only the yellow. Yellow's really easy to get off. Look at that. It's beautiful, you guys. That is gorgeous. Got the big ring holes. That is gorgeous. Okay, it is a soap with cinnamon sugar. Nice. So I'll just transfer that to a new bottle. We got a. Well, it's really pretty. Look at the ruffles. It's a curtain. It's a damn curtain. Grab it at the top, please. There we go. So it's a beautiful ruffled curtain. It's very thin. It's, it's got a little yellow on it, but that is, that is really cute. We got a, um, these are the, when they got the silver inside, those are the dark out curtains. These are amazing. But that is beautiful print. I love that. Love the big O-rings. A matching set. Shoot. Heck yeah, we might have to do another um, get the paint off of it video for you guys. If we don't have time to do that, 
If you do scroll down our page, we do have a recipe to get the paint off. And we show you every step of the way. This is a bed skirt, and it's a wraparound. Um, I don't see any paint on it. These are the nice ones, too, that just wrap around the bed where you ain't got to mess with the top mattress that's a size full. That's pretty awesome. Thank you. Thank you, Marsha. That's beautiful. That's awesome. Um, it's a bed skirt. Okay. It's a bed skirt. That's what it is. Yep. Yep, definitely. And for a size. I don't know, but I love those ruffles. 78 by 80. That I love that ruffle, that print. That is beautiful. Again, I don't see any spray paint, guys. That is crazy. No spray paint. Alright, so we got another bed skirt. Awesome. Well, these are amazing. And guys, these actually hold really well. You wouldn't believe the hold these actually have. Mm -mm, no spray paint on it again. I might keep this one. Hi. Another one. Yeah, buddy. Thank you so much, Marsha. Guys, I have two. Yay. All right, we got one pillow. Beautiful. Only some spray paint, no tears. Thank you, Bed Bath and Beyond. Again, spray paint, no tears. Just what we like to wear. Well, I guess we don't wear pillows, but we love them. And, the therapeutic and they are. They're nice and heavy, nice and soft. Oh boy, coffee. Coffee is in the bag. <laughs> Alert, coffee is in the bag. <laughs> Crap. Oh boy. Okay, um that is a it looks like a seat or back it's a cushion. Fit. Yep, sure is. How would you know? Um because I could see it too. That appears to be a back cushion or well I it's guess really it could soft. be a seat cushion. That is really cool. I'm going to have to, of course, unzip it and um, get that <laughs> coffee off of there. Oh, shoot. They didn't. Tell me they didn't. Not all of them. No. They're not even open. Okay. Thank goodness. I was going to have a cow. <laughs> they did some of them. What? What? Give it to me, baby. Ugh. Uh-huh. <laughs> yes, baby. <gasps> Whatever. Yes. Ugh, you guys. Going on the bed. Getting a wash and going on the bed. Getting a wash. Going on the bed. Don't care about the spray paint. Don't care about the spray paint. That is amazing. Ugh. What? What? Yes. Thank you. Bed Bath and Beyond, and thank you, Jesus. Yes. All right, um, the rest are these little coffee pods that we, well, no, hold on, hold on. I'll speak it too soon. I don't, oh, this appears to be a little hamper. What, what is that? Oh, it's a paper towel holder. Heck to the, yeah. That's cool. I dig that. Right on. All right. No spray paint, guys. I don't know what this is. Okay, so this is just a pop-up hamper. What? Whatever. <gasps> the freaking cord's cut. not cut. This is um, a CVS score with a couple of TJ Maxx things on top. All right, you guys, look at this beautiful rug. It's just got a little bit of spray paint down there, and it's yellow. Red is the hardest to get off. Yellow is, like, super easy. And it actually matches some rugs that we found a year or two ago. So, that is beautiful. Moving right along, I know this was from Marsha. And it's one of those um, things that go over your furniture for your pets. And it goes either on your couch or whatever. And it has not a bit of spray paint on it. I don't know what size it's for. But, um, yeah. So, Marsha, thank you again. 
There's also a shower curtain rod, and it is... It's all here. Tight and stainless. Not even open. Yeah, it's still... How it's long still is it? 52, so it is 52... 52.86. By 86. Brand new shower curtain, 52 by 86. Not even out of plastic. Um, this... I'm so sorry about my phone, you guys. Um, this mop handle... I think it's a dust mop. It's the same brand as the regular uh, spin mop, but I think we're missing the um, duster head, but I bet you that's easily replaceable. So we got that. This is from Marsha, and um, it's from Bed Bath & Beyond, and it's a beautiful black um, fold-down chair. The only thing was... Um, this side right here when we did it had to hook onto there somehow and I think we might have to re I don't know yet I don't know. but we're not gonna do it right now so there's the chair it's just you know your basic fold-up chair I think it needs a little work on the other corner sorry about that guys I had to stop the phone from dinging all right so we found this beautiful so show them the front hun Look at this beautiful, oops, collision, beautiful um, cloth-based drawer dresser. So let's hope it's all in there because Aaron needs one. And again, shitting his pants for you one video at a time. All right, we got the drawers. Appear to be in good shape. Perfect. Oh, it's metal. That makes me happy. I thought it was going to be plastic. Nice. Baby just scored a dresser, didn't he? He needed one, guys. We actually were just talking about finding him something. And But like I said, y'all, when we always talk about finding something, God provides. God always provides. It is crazy. That is amazing. Oh, Thank you, God. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. That is beautiful. Lovely. Wonderful. It seems to be all there, you guys. If it's missing any of the hardware, which I don't think it is, he pulled out that bag of screws right there. Um, I think that he just scored a dresser, guys. So, yeah, that's amazing. Wonderful. You happy, baby? Yeah. Yeah. All right, you guys. All right, guys, moving right along. We got some uh, crispy something or others. We got two of these eight-hour Cold Max, uh, Cairo Max Cold Pro um, back cooling technology. But we did get two of those. Um, small dogs adjustable collar. Helps calm and relax your dog. We got some dog treats. We got some more Pedialyte in a bag. So we won't mess with it. Yeah, buddy. Dish soap score. Heck yeah. A bath mat from Medline. This guy was from um, TJ Maxx. Trick or treat, trick or treat. <laughs> <laughs> Heck yeah, one arm, one arm little uh, pirate, pirate skeleton. Hey, hold on, dude, bro. All right, chill, chill, little guy. And then another Medline bath mat. No, that's drive. Oh, drive bath mat. Well, it looks like the Medline. This one's actually heavier. Oh, look, it looks more cushiony too. Huh. So we got two bath mats. Heck, we got three bath mats. Okay, so that one was longer. So the drive one is longer than the Medline. And it also appears to be fluffier. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. All right. Heck, yeah. Individuals. Fo fo I can never say that word. Faux mink. All right. So we already did the Tide. Is that full? Yes. Wow. Is it H-E? Yeah. Yes, sir. Free and gentle. Thank you, CBS. All right. 
We got some little Cap'n Crunches, little bowls. Aaron will love those. We got um, Mighty Muffin Cinnamon Roll. Huh, that's different. More trolls. Troll. Well, I call them trolls, but they're Aaron, one of Aaron's favorites, so I bet he's having a heyday. Goldfish. Not sure how those are. Those are from uh, the pet store, but they're cat chew vitamin type theme of bobbers. Antibacterial wipes. What? More of the Smash Krispies. Nasal aspirator. Oh dear. Okay, so that's the one for the mom where she sucks it out of the baby's nose. And um no no shame to the moms that do that, but um I couldn't I, I don't think I could do it. Used nasal strips. That's what everybody wants. How used are they? <laughs> Let's see. Okay, they are individually wrapped, so we're good. All right. Bavita protein blueberry almond gummy worms. We got some different poor minimizer witch hazel. Yeah. Mineral oil. Awesome. Breathable. Topical. Nivea. Lotion addict. Hello. We got some Mighty Muffin Double Chocolate. That one's going to be for me to try. And we got some CeraVe. Rough and bumpy. Uh, brand new uh, breathable nail polish. Some Biotin Max. Uh, the seal's been broken on the outside. Um, what that's is that? Dandy. Oh, that's one of the masks for your neck and your face. Heck to the yeah, I've been wanting one of these. All right. We got Lindor Truffles. We got something blueberry. It's fine. Just throw it away. I mean, not throw it away, but throw it down there. We got another effing... 400 watt CVS wrist thing. This is like the fifth one we've found. This is amazing. Let me know if you guys want a nurse or um, some type of uh, box like that with like these sort of things inside it. A uh, pick for your teeth, um, you know, uh, these things, something like that because we've got quite a few of them. Pick for your teeth? Yeah, the, the, the water pick. Water pick is what I was trying to say. <laughs> Speaking of water pick, <laughs> there's another one. All right, yeah, so see, we got even more. <gasps> Glam and Glow? What? At CVS? <gasps> it hasn't. And Glam and Glow is so expensive. I can't close it right now, so I'll deal with it later. All right, so we got some brand new Suave, uh, I mean Secret, um, Extended Protection Deodorant. A brand new Dove deodorant. Holy crap. A two pack of the Suave Gel. More trolleys. We got some more leggings. What size, honey? Doesn't say. Doesn't say at all? No. I would think they're either smalls or kids because they're pretty small. Oh, cool. Uh, what are those called? <gasps> Give it to me, baby. Uh huh, uh huh, my favorite shit. Uh huh, uh huh, yeah, yeah, yeah. CVS is doing me so good today. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yes. Pomegranate blueberry? Um, don't mind if I do. Thank you. And they're actually freezing cold. So this has been opened a little bit on the bottom. Be perfect for a box sale. Because you can tell that it hasn't been all the way to the top. Sarah V. Skin Renewing Night Cream. Another deodorant. And that one is still sealed. Nice. We have some Orbit Gum. Still sealed. We got some more Lindor Truffles. We got some Ritz Crackers. And it is missing one little thing. We got some magnesium gummies. So we got some um, three pair, size five to nine, ladies' trouser socks. Ooh, those smell good. These are reusable dryer sheets. What? Smell them. Oh, MG from Meyer Lavender. Yes. Y'all, that is so cool. Protein. 
Oh, there's a little leak. It appears to be that it came loose when someone opened it or something. Nice. Grand's cookies. Fig Newtons. Ha <laughs> Yeah, buddy. Y'all know how long it's been since we bought trash bags? Oh, boy. That's part of a loving to be a... Yes! 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 More deodorant. More kind bars and more treats. More trolleys more treats. And another back um, cooling thing. We're almost done, guys. And the arm to the skeleton. Heck yeah. And another deodorant that's not open. And a brand new Con Airbrush. Y'all, the boxes that I am going to... Wow! That I'm going to make out of all these items is going to be epic. Just like this haul. I needed this so bad. That is amazing. Like I said, when you need, God always provides. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, CVS. Y'all, that was epic. It is a wreck. We got all this to clean up. So we're going to say goodbye. And we love you guys. And we appreciate everything you do for us. And thank you so much for watching. Y'all don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Hit that subscribe button. Comment down below. Let us know what your favorite find was. Let us know what you want in these boxes. Love you, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye! Bye.